Welcome to Jacksonville, Florida, and thank you for coming to help JEA in our time of need. Hi, my name is Roger Parker, and I'm a safety and health specialist here at JEA with the Water Wastewater Group. We want to provide you with a virtual mutual aid safety briefing for restoration events for our responding water partners. Remember, if your company's safety standards are more stringent than OSHA's, please follow your company requirements. Also, please remember that all down power lines shall be treated as energized until proven otherwise. Always wear all your required PPE inspected prior to use. Remember, if a pole is not locked and tagged out, it is not de-energized. Coordinate with your maintenance coordinator in your area for lockout tagout procedures. All work must be completed under the supervision of a licensed class three distribution system operator per the Florida Department of Environmental Protection. At JEA, we know that job safety briefings are an important safety tool. This briefing should include hazards, mitigations, and updates to the briefings based on changes in scope, personnel, equipment, or environmental concerns. When it comes to protecting your vehicle and job site, be sure to deploy all MOT devices, use as many cones as needed for proper coverage and safety, utilize an observer for flagmen to keep the public out of the work zone and for traffic safety. Place cones around your vehicle if you are parked in the roadway and wear your traffic vest on the job and in staging sites. These are busy areas and increase your invisibility. Florida has a lot of low-lying areas and swampy areas. Use insect repellent and be on the lookout for poisonous snakes while you're here. Watch where you place your hands and feet. If there is standing water, there could be alligators. Enough said. Florida is known as the Sunshine State, so please be sure to use as much sunblock as needed and protective clothing to cover exposed skin. Hydration is critically important. Drink plenty of liquid, but avoid caffeine and alcoholic beverages. Seek shade when available or when needed. No JEA contract employee will be required to work in dangerous weather. Please be kind and courteous and professional with all of our residents and customers, even the demanding ones. A JEA representative will be assigned to you to assist with any of these issues. If you are unsure about anything, check with your JEA assigned representative. Also, please remember you have to report all incidents to 904-665-HERT. You must complete an incident report form and provide it to the appropriate JEA manager or designatee for your crew within 24 hours. Under no circumstances will safety be sacrificed for speed or projected deadlines. Night work must be well planned and organized. Personnel must be trained and able to safely execute their assigned duties. Environmental concerns such as SSOs, which is our sanitary sewer overflows, and fuel spills must be reported immediately. Report them to your JEA representative or directly to JEA's Environmental Incident Response Line, which is area code 904-620-9921, followed by notification to your JEA representative. Also, spills must be contained as quickly as possible to mitigate damage to the environment. If this restoration event occurs during the pandemic, do the following protection and prevention techniques to help stop the spread. Do the five. Wash your hands often. Use sanitizer when soap and water aren't available. Call for sneeze into your elbow. Keep your hands away from your face. Stay six feet apart. Also, if you feel sick, stay home. One note, any federal, state, or local executive orders regarding quarantine, PPE, curfews, etc., will always take precedence and shall be followed. Check with your JEA representative for current masking policies that may be in place. Again, my name is Roger Parker, and I am a safety and health specialist here at JEA with the Water Waste Water Group. My contact info is 904-349-6108. Please feel free to call me at any time, contact me with any questions you may have. And again, thank you for coming to help JEA.